Earlier this week, we had a flash mob walk down Grammy Street of all of the bagpipers and drummers of the entire tattoo. We wanted everybody to know that the tattoo was in town, the performers are all here, we wanted everybody to get excited. People initially look slightly confused, uh, thinking what's happening here, uh, but then, you know, they pick up fairly quickly and it's, it brightens somebody's day. You know, it's something you don't expect and then you, you see, you know, a couple of hundred pipers marching up Granby Street. Uh, it's definitely not something that you see every day, so yeah, it was good. Backstage at the Virginia International Tattoo, you'll see dancers from one country playing with pipes in another country. You'll see the people kind of interacting with each other on different levels. And we, we do have about 850 performers from seven nations coming in, seven to eight nations depending on the year. So, you know, you will have cultural barriers, but honestly, music is the language of everybody and it's all about the music, it's all about the camaraderie, and it's a really great experience. I want to make sure I know everything about the music that I can so that I don't let the musicians down. I don't want to make their job harder. Today, I'm still going to be score studying during the show, in between the acts, I always go back to the score. I have to absorb myself to make sure, no matter how many times I'm going to perform it, that I'm not missing anything. It's busy. Uh, it's very busy, actually. We've been working hard to put on a, you know, a really good show uh, for everybody who, who attends. Uh, it's, it's coming along. You know, we've had a, a few little hiccups, but that's uh, par for the course with any tattoo. Uh, we've ironed most of those out now, uh, and we're looking forward to getting into the performances. <laughs> The Tattoo Hullabaloo is a great preview of what you're about to see inside. Um, we'll have bagpipers, of course. We'll have international groups come out and do a mini performance. We'll have Highland dancers. And then we'll also bring in other groups that aren't exactly a part of the tattoo that just add to the experience. Everyone's been welcomed here to celebrate the 60th anniversary of the Norfolk NATO Festival. It is our flag raising ceremony and it is our premier event to kind of kick off the festival and to welcome everyone. The flag raising ceremony is a ceremony that is meant to be a recognition of the Alliance and all of its member nations. There are now 28 member nations and of course with the raising of the flags and the playing of uh, the national anthems it's a way to recognize and honor those nations. This year, one of my personal favorites is Her Majesty's The King's Guard from Norway. These are a group of elite young men from Norway, and they are amazing musicians and also equally as amazing as, as a drill team. They're very precise at marching in line, amazing at the choreography of their, of their routine, and they're honestly about 16 to 18 years of age, so it's really stellar to watch young men and women be that precise on their, on their job level. What I love the most about a tattoo is playing the combined music with a band of 200 plus with 125 to 150 bagpipers with it, and then adding the magic of a chorus on top of it. There's just nothing like it. You know, there's acts far and wide, uh, and I think you know there's really something for everyone in there, so it's, it's definitely worthwhile coming along. The Virginia Arts Festival has made it its mission to bring world-class arts to Hampton Roads area, and I think it honestly has served that purpose. The Virginia International Tattoo is a great example of that.